Welcome to Grab Shiny. My name is John. I'm Zach. This is going to be the EA, uh, not EA, we did that yesterday. This is going to be uh, Microsoft E3 2017 press conference reactions. Yeah. Um, we did fuck up a little bit. I just want to be uh, obvious about that. We saw a little bit of the press conference already because uh, we missed out recording our webcam. So we went back. Um, but it's alright. Everything from like the second game will be all fresh still yeah. to us. Um, but so far... You know, it was it was okay. I was like, I get it. Y'all are talking about stuff pretty well, actually. Because, you know, when, when people talk about bullshit, you're just like, mm -hmm. all right, come on, come on. Yeah. And a few of them, a few of them was a little bit bullshitty, but like... Yeah, they, they have to... You will know the moment when we were like, holy fucking shit. They, they have to talk up, um... They have to talk up the Scorpio. Because that's getting announced, for sure. Like, or it's already announced... But it's officially shown yeah. today. Different name, too. Uh, yeah, you'll see that we'll in a minute. Um, if you haven't seen the press conference before. If you want to see the press conference without a reaction, check the description. I'll give you the link. Um, so that yeah. way you don't have to watch this if you don't want to. Um, if you're just looking for the actual press conference. I know it can be a bitch to find sometimes. Um, but yeah. so far of what we saw at the conference, it was kind of dragging ass. But then they started kicking to overdrive, and that's when we fucking realized, yeah. oh no, our shit's not recording. But luckily, we're just watching the bot. Like, it started coming up a little bit, and then they talked about a specific game, and I was like, ah, okay, whatever. And then another dude came out, and I'm like, don't worry, we got a lot of stuff we're gonna talk about. And I was like, yeah. oh shit, okay. <laughs> yeah. Alright, I'm down. What 4K! Up, well, now, since we kind of know this, the, the front end of the press conference is front loaded with bullshit about the new console. Um, so we can make some predictions now, if you want. We don't have to pay too much attention. I just don't know what I would expect that's new. They said, like, God, you know, I, I don't want to say what they said, because it's, it's so magical. When he, when he just came to be, out and just to be real. Okay, so I owned an Xbox. I owned an Xbox 360. I think you're the same way, right? Yeah. You don't own an Xbox One? No. You don't have anything against the Xbox One? Because I played it. Um, uh, the menus are weird. But yeah, the whole not, UI sucks, but... Um, it's not terrible, because, like, the 360's UI was, like... Good sometimes, good. bad some other times. And then when they went to the new shit, it was weird. That but looked like Windows 10, it, it yeah. kind of looks like shit. And you get but, used to it, and it's not too hard to navigate. It's just not perfect. Um, But the, the Xbox One's UI is just kind of shit, and it's yeah. very confusing, so... And they might have changed it since like, we last played it, so who knows. To but. be fair... A lot of UIs are kind of weird anyway. Yeah. Until you get used to it. Like, the PS4s at first, too, for me, was a little like... I was like, what the fuck? What are all these squares yeah. in a fucking long I still ass think line, the you know? PlayStation 4s could be improved a lot by yeah. adding... Giving us the ability to add folders, um, and that might be a thing already, then, but... We really buckled down why I didn't get a 1 compared to, because I was, I was more an Xbox guy after... PS3's yeah. fucking big debacle. Of costing too much. And then the games were harder to make, so they would end up looking better on 360. Because yeah. people didn't know how to port to it. And the controller wasn't as good as the PS2 controller. And the 360 controller was great. It was I perfection fucking, almost. Ah. Except for the outside of the D-pad. Like, yeah. as far as for 3D games, it's pretty much perfect. The D-pad's fucking garbage. Garbo. But, but as long as you use it for very slim things, like maybe switching something. Like, that was the only time. When you ever had to yeah. just press it, like, once... Doing any kind of movement or anything across it and shit. I will also say mm -hmm. I prefer the flatter buttons of the PlayStation controllers compared yeah. to the jutting out ones. But, like, it's that's minor, you know? And it worked straight into PCs, so yeah. there's double of reasons to get it. So this is the new Xbox One, uh, the Scorpio. Yeah. Uh, its name's about to be revealed in a second. It looks nice. It, it looks clean. It looks clean. really sleek. And, uh... You know. The way they describe it is pretty impressive as well. I wish they would still do something with that control. There's just something. It feels weird in my hands. And I don't like the bumpers. The bumpers feel like shit to me. That's I'm not the biggest, biggest fan of the 360 bumpers. I don't like how small they are. Oh. So I do like the bigger... I like how you can press anywhere on the bumper and it works. You, you can't for fucking... You just shit. press the very end. Yeah, you press the, the outers. Yeah. But I press in. Uh, and like that's where like the buttons don't go down. I think that's where I would press too. So, so yeah, it's a problem. That's what fucks me up a little bit. Um, so uh, that way I have to like put my fucking fingers back like this instead yeah. of just resting it. It's weird. But I, I, you know, we're at least I like I, I consider myself a collector of games for sure and yeah. consoles. So like, 
I want an Xbox One, some iteration you of it. You just gotta give me a fucking reason to buy it. Yeah, if Game not, two. I'll wait. If not, I'll wait until. Uh, I'm gonna wait until after. Yeah. After it's already done, and I can pick the little games here and there. Yeah. If anything. Right now, they have one game. So here's the Xbox guy. Yeah, we know him. Phil Spencer. And then these three points, which which have been true for a regular Xbox and 360. I feel like well, I don't the think, one has been like... Yeah, it was weaker. Yeah. I don't know if that applied to the 360, because it was weaker technically too. But like, Yeah, but 360 still had some pretty good um, exclusives. And like, yeah, but that wasn't about that. That was about being powerful. You was know, like so easy on the 360. Not even just playing with friends, just like talking to your friends in general. You can yeah. be playing two different things with the party chat. Like anything online for PS3 sucked until like years later. Yeah, and that was after like I was like, fuck the PS3. You know? Yeah. So Xbox One X is what it's officially called. Not the Scorpio. Weird. Weird. Dumb. Yeah. Bad name. But they're just filled with bad names. <clears throat> like, I get the S. Whatever. It's short for slim. It's fine. <clears throat> if we call that name dumb, do we think Mega Man X is a dumb name, too? Think about this shit. Look, man. <laughs> it's that whole stupid thing behind X being a variable, and he has infinite potential bullshit. Yeah. And that's why. Maybe that's why they call it X. You know, maybe. Um, Fuck. But the... But it's already an X box. Now, from what we saw, we haven't seen... Um, what if it was called the Xbox One 2? Oh, that'd be so stupid. <laughs> I'm sorry, go ahead. We haven't seen a price yet. <laughs> yeah, it's true. Even, like, the spots that we saw, we did not see we, a price. We've heard about a price, and uh, we've made price guessing. Jeff Keeley, God of Games, Doritos Pope... Um, Mountain Dew King. Mountain Dew King put out it will be four ninety nine. Yeah. And if there's anyone that has the scoop, it's Who Jeff Keeley. Fucking Keeling. knows, yeah. And also he just put it out as well. Now, could have Mike could Microsoft have used that against him? Like give him false knowledge? They could, but I don't know if he would take that. <laughs> he's just <coughs> laughing at him afterwards. He's just like, I'll fucking get you guys. You done fucked up. No one fucks with Jeff Kaylee. Cause really, he he he's the press. He yeah, is, he's the press, and video games live and die off of that press. He's you know? like the fucking the gaming like <laughs> spokesman, like really, like yeah. he's like he's like our spokesman. You know, everybody's yeah. he runs he runs the you know? the game awards, and no, so no matter what you think he's, about him, he like he's the mm-hmm. voice of the gamers, and he's very like just flat you know he's not super opinionated he just delivers the news yeah. and he knows how to get it and that's good and he works with developers so he probably knows so much that we don't know so this so is the thing this part was weird all xbox one accessories and games will work on xbox and one x as well, why, why wouldn't it you know it's not a new system it's it's just a okay. an upgrade basically so here's the worry not all do will all Xbox One X games work on Xbox One? Yeah, that's a worry. I don't think they will if they're exclusive. I, I think, think it'll be like the new 3DS games. He, you know? but I think a lot like the new 3DS games. I don't think we're gonna see a lot of them. Mm-hmm. I think that's a fucking waste of money for developers to pursue. There might be a few Microsoft games that try to do it to make the most out potential, but I don't think yeah. we're gonna see it much. Because Microsoft's about the money. Yeah. You know, they're not out here to fucking but then they change said, lives. This like right here, like, you don't have to have a 4K TV. Finally, it's going to so look better. It's going to, like, it's going to downsample itself to still look better right. than it normally does on 1080. Yeah. Which is good. Because otherwise, if you just naturally downsampled, it'll look like shit. Right. It's kind of like how we record games that are 30 frames per second in-game at 60 at frames 60. per second anyway. Because yeah. it's still going to look slightly better. Yeah, regardless. You um, know. I'm sure that's not obviously not the same exact thing, but um, they got a fast processor. So, also, what were you thinking the whole time, right here? It's like, is it gonna be like 360? This bitch sounds like it's gonna overheat. It's gonna melt like crazy. It's gonna fucking melt. But then he's like, "Fuck you, bitch! Check <laughs> heard, this shit out." I heard what the fuck you said. 
Liquid cooling. Cool vapor Holy chamber. Shit, Holy look at shit. that. Dude. It looks like the fucking dude's visor from fucking uh, Star Trek. I don't even have a fucking liquid cooled vapor chamber in my computer, you know? It's a little unnecessary, but we have fat PCs. There's a lot of room. <clears throat> this is a small which, which brings system. us Which brings us to our next point. Like, or his next point. Yeah. Not this point. Not this point. This point's cool too, but... <clears throat> yeah. Look at that. It this just point. slaps together. Look at that. Like a sandwich. You gotta assemble it. I'm just kidding. <laughs> Wait, no. Not only have we built the most powerful console ever, Xbox One X is the smallest Xbox ever. That is yeah. crazy. Xbox. <laughs> Xboxes in general have always been kind of big. Big, yeah. You know? Outside of like this some of the 360 models, but like. Yeah. The fact that it's smaller than all the other Xboxes is huge because they don't need as much ventilation with the liquid cooled, you know? Yeah. <clears throat> Hopefully. Right? Hopefully. We'll see. Fingers crossed. Okay, look, guys. Look, guys. They're going to talk about this game for a bit that me and Zach don't give a shit about. But we understand why it's important. Yeah. See, look. It's Red Dead. It's not Red Dead. <laughs> uh, it's we Assassin's thought, Creed. We thought Egyptian. it was. That's exactly what we thought. We thought it was Red Dead or Assassin's Creed. Which had yeah. Assassin's Creed. So once you see those cities in the background, we're like, well, maybe those are just like weird, like old structures in, in Egypt. And then there were camels, and I was like, yeah. oh. And then I saw this. And then like, there's a car. Then I saw this. I was like, oh, is that a weird assassin I was outfit? Like, <laughs> I saw the car twice. And I was like, no, that's that's a car, right? Yeah, that's a car. Okay. This is fucked. Yeah, <laughs> nice butt. Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> Why'd you sound like that? Oh God! But yeah, I and you know I like like I said I've never really got played Forza, but I do like Gran Turismo. I just yeah, I don't. Oh, yeah. We always thought it was called Forza as well. It's called Forza. Yeah, Forza. Also, Porsche is Porsche. Is Porsche. And I'm pretty sure I knew that, but just I you don't know, call it that. I've never heard anyone ever say Porsche instead of Porsche. I've only ever heard people that even own fucking Porsches say Porsche. Now this you know? this segment goes on forever. <laughs> it goes on for a long time, but it has a purpose because cars are the easiest thing to show off new graphics in, and this, yeah. this looks nice. It just we don't care. Yeah. Um, I don't I don't play realistic racers. Even if I even if I do buy this game yeah. one day, right? This is not exciting me to. Uh, that was cool that there were semi trucks. I just this, saw that. This is not the thing to where. You're going to convince me to buy Xbox One. Xbox One because of Forza. You know? Yeah. But it's cool. And then, like, you know, some guy comes out and talks about this shit. Forever. Which is fine. Um, it's the demonstration that's going to piss me off again. Yeah. After I see it. So. He does emphasize supercars, which is, like, probably the funner of those racing games you know after a while like it's cool working your way up yeah but once you hit the supercar level it's it's way different you know yeah i like the idea of working my way from a shit car to a good car yeah but the feeling's weird if you try to go backwards you know absolutely like, so once you hit that the fact that like he's like it emphasizes a lot of that too so there's a lot of uh End yeah. game stuff because supercars are the end game. And also, and like when you show off games. when you show off a racing game, you can't show off a fucking uh, Mitsubishi Eclipse. You know, <laughs> like no one's getting fucking excited. Yeah. <laughs> it might be in the Get game, that. but you can't show it off. Getting that shitty ass <clears throat> car. Okay. Also, this is not our fault. This happened last time. Something happened on the stream. Yeah. Um, so we're watching it through a GameSpot thing. Yeah. Um, I might try to get you guys a better version of it. We'll um, if they have it cleaned up by then, if you want to see in the description, but we'll see. Um, Look, there's the car that's up there on the screen, but in real life. It's a Porsche. It looks less realistic than the fucking car up there. Like, wait, hold on. <laughs> this whole thing is just like... Weird? Yeah. Yeah. Like, no one in... Like, I don't know, if you're like... no you even properly like... He should have, like, showed it like this and then have an in-game model displayed at, like, the same angle with some yeah, similar yeah. lighting and shit. And be like, this is what it looks like in the game. This is this. Yeah, and I assume that's its purpose, so that way you can... But look at this fucking Photoshop picture yeah, right up here. Yeah, look good. 
the lighting's I all mean, crazy it, from the back. And it like, does look like a good picture. It just is not, not realistic. Not comparison, yeah. you know? Yeah. I guess that's the, the idea. You're supposed to see the car, and then when you see it in the game, you're like, oh, okay, that looks right. Yeah. But. And here's some here's some racers. <laughs> These two ladies up here who are professional race car drivers, and they, they're going to be playing, playing the, game. the game. But as you can see, they're not even playing the game at all. Yeah. And not even like the like kind of bullshit way, like most fucking conferences. So like, it kind of goes into like the start of them. Of them racing. Race right there, but. But like, look, see how it just goes in this weird cutscene? And then. And then, then they're the racing. Fucking racing. Unless they're really good on the fly fucking switching videos and shit of footage back and forth too. Yeah. I doubt it. They fuck up too much for that to They're rely switching on that. between so many different things. Too. Yeah. So they this, this is this fucking is, all recorded. And the, it would be fine if they just showed this, right? Yeah. But the fact that they showed the ladies doing it, it's like playing the before. game. I was like, no, they're not fucking playing shit. You just brought them out to. Like, to look, be, we're we're real racers. We like Forza. Cool. <laughs> oh, oh, cool. All right. Huh. You know. If this was me, I'd be I'd be slamming into these motherfuckers in the corners. Yeah. Knocking them off the track. Oh, I think Forza has damage though, right? So maybe not. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. oh, maybe it is switching back between them. It could be. Now that I'm seeing it again, but, like I'm starting to think, yeah, it is. But the fact that how it started was so weird. Well, Unless that's they were playing throughout a lot of that already. The Forza games start you already going. Do they? Yeah. Oh, I didn't know that. I just they like start a, as a like a just like a, a thing. oh. No, they start yeah. like just like a real race. They because you do a, a, a lap, lap, yeah, and then you start racing. Yeah, like that's it. Just starts you like. Does Gran racing. Turismo do that too? No, it starts you at a stop. Okay, that's that, that's what's confusing me because I've played Gran Turismo before and I was like, yeah, I'm pretty sure you start at the stop, but yeah. you do do the lap thing still. I think in Gran Turismo, and some of them. Nope, uh, you do just go there. You can qualify, but like, yeah, no, this one's like, you race, you stay in line. That way, when you hit the starting line, you go fucking full speed. You're already, like... It won't count off your laps because you had to go from zero to nothing to uh, get up, you know? I well, don't know. I That's it, the way people race. It's weird. Like, if you watch NASCAR or indie racing, like, they do the same thing. They do a couple laps, and then all of a sudden the green flag comes out. Yeah. It's weird. Yeah. We don't know anything about this shit, to be honest. Well, so, if me. we're wrong about anything, fuck it. post in the comments. Yell at me. Come at me. Tell me I'm dumb. I don't give a shit. <laughs> I don't play for it, so. 9-11. Oh, God. Not this again. <laughs> Forza. I had no idea this whole time. I missed it, him saying the 9-11 part the first time. Like 20 times it says 9-11. 9-11. You'll like Forza. <laughs> Otherwise, you're a supporter of 9-11. It's like, oh, my God. Don't say that, bro. All right. <laughs> Xbox, so this is, the, this is the this is the part this is the part of the money. Listen closely. Okay, not this part. This part sucks. <laughs> yeah, yeah, no. <clears throat> Cars. Okay. Sixty frames per second. Cool. Cool. They, I'm pretty sure they all are. This. Okay, they say that every time. That means diverse. Nothing. I was like, well, what the fuck are you talking about? And he said, ever shown. And I was like, okay, hold up. Words that mean nothing. Yeah. Give us numbers. 42 games. We and. Only, and. 22 games with console exclusivity. 22 console exclusive games. That, that's literally like uh, we've been asking for reasons to buy an Xbox. Now the question is are they timed exclusives? Yeah. That's the big question. But he did say exclusivity. like. And how many of these are just indie games that will also be on Steam? Yeah. Now we only saw this they, first game. They better not appear on fucking Windows Store. They better, they better be on the system and that's it. No, it'll absolutely be on the Windows like, Store. And there's no reason for me to ever get the Xbox One, you know? No, bro. They already said that there never will be. Yeah. 
there but then be shit, like man. you know like I don't know if I if I don't want to buy things on the Windows Store because of shenanigans of Windows Store shut down if games for Windows Live taught me anything it's not to fucking trust them yeah with that type of shit so we did see this game this is the only one we stopped it right after this one and we guessed it right away immediately I saw this I this was like, is like is this Metro it looks like Metro that's Metro that's Metro <laughs> yeah um, I've played Metro 2033 uh, the before the Redux actually god look how fucking clean this shit yeah, looks yeah it looks man. so good the little effects on the uh, on his gas mask are nice too. Yeah, I like the world of twenty thirty three, but before the Redux, at least the fact there's that a lot of gameplay problems. Out and it like it fogs up for a second, and yeah. it breathes in, and it goes away. I'm pretty sure when you start sprinting and stuff, it gets more intense too. So like, and you'll have like an oxygen meter sometimes. Yeah, or there was like some way to tell because he has a gas mask on because the world's like. Fucked up. Fucked up, and if he breathes in the air, it's bad for him. So, this is pretty neat. I didn't play Last Light, so I don't know where the story went. <coughs> oh! Fuck you. It's a big rat. God, that is. I don't even remember what the enemies were in 2033. I think it was mixed between monsters and humans. Yeah, there were definitely humans, but I mean the monsters... Cause I remember because the monsters were always easier to fucking fight. <laughs> yeah. Because you just shot them. Because the, the humans, humans... I mean, they'd shoot back. ...would snipe your ass over a mile yeah. away. That was one of the big problems. And you couldn't stealth around them because once they found you once... It they was magically like, know where you're at. at no matter times. where, forever, for their whole it's rest still, of the level. You know. <clears throat> but they probably fixed that at Redux, so don't, you know... Avoid the game on account of my... Just version like of things. version, yeah. This one looks cool, man. Makes me think this, of Doom. So <clears throat> it's I a lot. Like it's a very it's a slow plotting game. Yeah, it's way different. But this is the weird shit. He just takes <clears throat> off his mask. He's like, "What the shit?" I said, "I don't know what happened to Last Light, but it looks like they found some type of sanctuary where everything's okay." Yeah. Look at that handy dandy map. I want. It's great. I wonder if that's a real map. Looks cool. Like they use in game, does he pull it up to his face? Even the sounds are the same when you go in and out with the Binox. The Binox. Binos. This is a cool ass <clears throat> weapon right here, this crossbow. I, I'm pretty sure this weapon was in 2033, so. Because I'm assuming you're the same character throughout the story. I don't remember, because I, I want to say things went pretty poorly for 2033's ending, but I'm not sure. Said I have no idea. I hear doggos. So do I. So this place isn't entirely safe. I don't remember going in this building at all, actually. No, I don't either. Oh yeah, I do, because he's gonna be like, "Let's look out this window." Oh shit! Damn <laughs> dog! Put that dog down. Look at this shit. I ain't wasting no ammo. Give me that back. I got more killing to do with this very specific dart. Oh, fuck. Oh, shit. Oh, oh they're running. Why are they running? Ah! It's a bear. It's a big dog. It didn't work. That's like me in a lot of games. <laughs> this will probably stop it for a second so I can figure out where to run. Oh, shit. Uh-oh. This I like because he like, switched ammo. Boom! And then that reload. That looks so cool how it reloads. Like it Down you fall, boy. Bye bye. Uh oh, oh zip line. Not. Get the fuck out of here. You see the bear zip lining behind him. You're like, oh no. <laughs> I heard a toot toot. What would that sound? Now, I, like I said, railroads play a big thing because you're in the metro in yeah. the game, right? Uh, you're like, Look, it's a friend. But like, don't know who that so is. So railroads play. Yeah, I don't know who it is either. Maybe I should remember, I but I don't. Probably at last light. Yeah. Or maybe it's just a totally new character. And this is where we pretty much got to. Yeah, we saw the um, name of the game, and I paused it. I was like, what's going on with the recording? And sure enough, yeah. it was fucked up. And then we saw Metro, and we were like, oh, fuck, yep. Yeah. It was Metro. This is game one. Exodus. Now, I don't know if I'll buy this game, but what I will say is this God is how you start it. a show. That looked great. 
Departing 2018. All right, go go right into another game. I haven't seen anything yet. Holy this is shit. all fresh. Go right into another game. Oh. World premiere. Oh. 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 Oh, God. Look at I that. told you I had a good fucking... I had a good feeling some. Well. That's Assassin's yeah. Creed. Yeah. There's the eagle. Look. Yeah, that's Assassin's Creed. Uh-oh, come, come on, on, Microsoft. Game spot. Yo, that Anubis helmet looked cool. Yeah. Where's my Anubis helmet? So is it going to be called Empires or Origins? I want to know. I've heard both both names. I don't know. That blood. Uh oh. That was oh, fucking fuck. cool. So apparently they've been working on this since before Unity. The, the Game Informer League came out. Show me some. Show me some good gameplay. Oh, give that sword. Well, there's some different kind of looking people here. Yeah, they're having the Coliseum. Hippo. Dude, hippos Swimming. are fucking dangerous, Gators. man. <clears throat> he was climbing the pyramid. Yeah. Oh, oh my on. god, a head got chopped off. There's the multiple arrow thing. There's the thing. multiple arrow thing, which is dumb as fuck, but okay. How, how are you able to fucking do that? The brother begins. Oh, shit. Giant snake. Fuck monster. yeah. <laughs> so it's Origins. Okay. I like that symbol. Hey. The, the little uh, forest thing between the I Assassin haven't played logo. Assassin's Creed since Unity, and Unity turned me away. But, I, you know, it's got my attention. Neither one of those are exclusive. Thank you. So that's Think not what they're... hit PC? Uh, well, everything will hit PC, but I think... Oh. I think those two will hit PS4 as well. Like, Assassin's Creed for sure. Yeah. <laughs> Come on, what the fuck? This is a recording, too. We're not... Yeah, we're not. This is a VOD. Hey, man. This is E3. <laughs> this is the way everyone else saw it, so this is the way we'll see it. Dark forces. Is it the Templus? Is it the people that are fucking up the stream? Are they a part of the Dark Forces? <laughs> he already had an accent, which is tough for me to understand. Like, yeah. RPG. Just like every Assassin's Creed. Did you call X-Bone one? How the fuck he did it? Just for you. Bayek is coming back. Siwa, his hometown, to kill the fake Oracle. Oh, they're going to show gameplay. Nice. Good job, That's man. what we like to see. Good job. I'm going to count these games off. I saw two. If we count four, a three. I even count four as a four. Ubisoft. When does Ubisoft become Ubi hard? I don't know. You haven't found the right girl yet. <laughs> yes, we know it stands for software dick bags. <laughs> Maybe I like hardware better. I heard you in the fucking comments. Wait. <laughs> <laughs> Trying to fuck it up. You mean software, bro? I what know. Are what are you done? <laughs> well, it's an assassin. We got a horseback. Well, there's the top uh, little compass thing you were talking right, about. Right, because there's no more mini map apparently. That's fine. That's fine. The reality is, you just go towards the points anyway. Yeah. Because you can climb on anything. So exactly. So there's the no terrain reason. doesn't really fucking matter. Yeah. You know. There's also a couple other things on this map up there. I see. 
Look at him slow down and take that corner. No one does that. Just Find fucking whip kill into Kill Madunaman. So this is the new Eagle Vision, apparently. Yeah. Which is interesting. Oh, you could set marker. Okay. Because in the old Eagle Vision, like, eventually you could just see through fucking walls all the time, you know? And it was dumb. This is pretty cool. So you had to actually had to put in a little bit of work. Oh. Masked one. You're fucked now. I'm gonna stab you, you fucking gold dust wearing guy. <laughs> I hope it shows them trying to climb towards a wall like ten times and they're not working. Oh. <laughs> and then finally like scooting to the side a few inches. Like, oh, got it. Apparently they move it to me it looks like Assassin's Creed. Like Yeah. Doesn't look too different. But they've been working on it for a long time. And I get it, Egypt, you have to like Got him. You have to like really know what the fuck you're talking about probably, but Yeah. You know, you can't just you can't just pull it out of your ass. Yeah. Like with the recent ones where it's like French and American history, that shit's easy to find, you know? So he can still mark people if he sees them. Ooh. That was cool. Got them both. You got an XP in the top right. Yeah. So do you level up? Yeah. Okay. Or, or not like well, that. But items have levels. Usually you can buy new items and new levels, so I wonder if you can upgrade the items. Yeah. Is that what it looks like? I don't know. You just... Well, now he has two bows for some reason. I remember hearing about that in the fucking Game Informer League. Yeah. Like, why would he have two bows? Maybe one does something better than the other. Because it's not like he's literally simultaneously using them. Yeah, I don't see how it would ever be faster to, like... It's not like you can dual wield, just like, yeah. or like... Or even single wield, like, and do it faster. <laughs> Got him. I only oh. see through wall a little bit. Oh, there's a guy up there, though. He's gonna watch out for... He should just pass him. He shouldn't go kill him. Where'd he go? Oh, he's up there. Now he's gonna get up from below. Oh, no. Yep. Oh, he, yeah, did. he did. Oh, ability points! Fucking sick. Show the ability points. Show them, damn it. So, I don't know if these will be, uh, if these some of these features were in uh, Syndicate or not. That was a weird thing, wasn't it? That, yeah. was, that was a weird transition. Oh! He actually went in for combat. That was... That guy's big. It's interesting. I like it. What? That he, that he went in there. Because sometimes, you know, shit goes down. A and lot of times, unfortunately, exactly. for me. Exactly. <laughs> so, Perry got him. Yeah. There's that insta-kill. No, well, he got his life down to do But, it. I mean, like, once, that was like the... Yeah. Oh, you motherfucker. Oh! What the fuck? <laughs> that was a little weird. Okay. Looks cool. I like it. I had a feeling we would see this here. Well, if the combat... The combat looked pretty straight. So, the arena parts of it will probably actually be cool. You know? Right. Is this Sea of Thieves? Call them YouTube games. Oh, live streaming. Sea of Thieves. Is it? Maybe. I want to see it. Oh. It, it makes sense, though, because this is um, that streaming thing right now, you know? It's very popular. Yeah. What is Mixer? It's a streaming thing. Like a website? 
It's built into the Xbox. Oh, okay. Does it just like push it to different streams? Oh, no, man. I mean, this game looks alright. Like, I could see the fun, but. Yeah. Same fun that DayZ has. Well, this probably accentuates more the, the combat than it does weirdly feeling survival. Yeah. Well, that's cool. Shipping with the final version. Whenever that is, guys. <laughs> yeah. Okay. I get it. It's fine. But this is one of these games that's like, it's been on PC, you know? So, it's nothing crazy. Yeah. God damn it, man. I know, fucking. It's like shit. GameSpot. I oh. say GameSpot, but I really mean Microsoft because it's them running the cameras, you know? Yeah. Everyone who's restreaming seeing the same thing we are. The only time it'll be fixed is when the recording comes out. Yeah. Like the actual recording. Game looks like PS1 game. <laughs> mm. Look at this 4K goodness. <laughs> looks looks the same as if you played it normally. This is a bad example. Oh. But I get it. They wanted to touch ground and saying that they're, as far as the systems goes, if you want it on a system, it will be on Xbox One kind of thing. You know. Yeah, and that type of appeal hits a lot of like younger people. Because I don't think there's a lot of these kind of games on that right now, as far as like Daisy and shit goes. I think Daisy's there, but is it? Yeah, because they do the. They're the only console that allows early access. So. Oh, uh, that was kind of fucking creepy right there. Yeah. For some but, you know, reason, it was just another player. If but. it was if it was you playing, you'd be jumping around and shit, trying to fucking. I try to jump around and. Oh. Fucking, you know, three sixty. No, 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 no pot. No pot. Exclusive. What's this? Launch exclusive. What? <laughs> For the X. Okay. This looks kind of fucking neat. It looks a lot like No Man's Sky, kind of. What is this? Oh no, it doesn't look anything like No Man's Sky. It's a low poly game. Yeah, it looks kind of fucking cool. I like low poly stuff. It's co op. You like diggers, man, which is kind of cool. Wonder what the goal is here. Obviously, oh. there's mining involved, and it's obviously Holy it's shit. obviously a crafting game, but. And I'm gonna go on a limb and say it's probably procedural. Probably. It makes sense for this kind of game, so. Yeah. Danger. Cool. Darkness. Dwarves. <laughs> you know? Well, it's kinda neat. Yeah, it looks like. I liked it. Okay. Last of Us? Is this Gears DLC? It looks too normal. Well, that's what Gears 4 started off looking like. Did it? Yeah, things that were back to normal, and then he went on to be a family man or something. I thought the world was already pretty fucked up. Dude, I don't know, man. I just know what I saw in the trailer. They were in a yard, looked nice. Uh -huh. Jesus Christ, come on. DZ. Again, they can't be. I don't know. It ultimately, it like, instantly looked uninteresting the moment the zombie showed up. Yeah, it's just like some weird survival, survival game. game. 
Yo, if this sh fucking stream, man. This is fucking. Come on. I know, Just man. Just let me, like, view it. Yeah. Like, fuck. It's being a little ridiculous. Like, how did they not know it's fucked up for this long? I don't know, man. Like, I figured they would have some kind of, like, mod on the trailer. Yeah. Someone watching the stream be like, oh, it's fucked up. I feel like I know what game this is. And I feel like I played the first one. Yeah, I, I think... I can't remember what the fuck I think you're right. We've actually seen this trailer before, I believe. No, I mean, like, I've played the first game. Yeah, we, sure. we've seen this trailer, and you told me these same exact words before. That was like the same exact house setup it looked like too. It's Fuck kind of funny. man. Oh, it looks like it's more expansive though. Yeah, cause like you can go out and stuff and kind of bring people, but you could play as different characters cause they have different stats and stuff. Right. It actually wasn't a terrible game, but there was there was shit wrong with it, you know. Maybe like a second game will fix that. Yeah. All right. Because like, you would go out and basically salvage and bring stuff back to your base <sighs> you know it was kind of like the the whole like if 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 Metal Gear Solid 5 was just more the not the main mission stuff you know it was just kind of you go out you salvage stuff and kind of just do things okay Fuck. Yeah. You could do funny stuff like open the car door and stuff like that. Knock the shit out of Zombo. <laughs> yeah. So that you was... know this game. It's, yeah. You don't remember his name. No. It'd be cool if I had some co-op to it. Cause, like, was there no co-op? What do you mean? I don't think there was, man, in the first game. Wait, so you just played by yourself? Yeah. That's fucking weird. State, State of Decay. That's exactly what I thought it right. was. I just couldn't remember the name. Because I played the first one. And it wasn't, like I said, it wasn't bad. It's just, yeah. god damn, I wish I could have seen that. You know? I don't know, man. I'm going to try to take it off auto, although I don't think it matters. To carry on. Oh, dodged. I remember people liking State of Decay. Yeah. It just, it, it could have been better. But it wasn't too bad. God fucking damn it. Bro, this is ridiculous. I'll oh, fuck it up. No, it's just a fucking loop, man. Yeah. Well, I would try not to find fucking GameSpot stream anymore. Yeah. But that's okay because, like, you know, as cool as the trailers are. I'm glad they had the icon for it again, basically. Yeah. Because it, like, you see it like that, but you can also see a skull, how it's shaped, too, which is really fucking cool. And I like Xbox One lot. console launch exclusive. Such a weird thing to say. This looks like Telltale. No. Yeah? A little bit. A lot. But... It doesn't have as thick of lines, though. Hard to say. It just kind of looks just like a another zombo. Yo, how many zombie games can we show? Lots, lots of zombo games, man. <laughs> what? The what the fuck? fuck? What? Was that Gears of War? <laughs> yeah, it's some weird survival game. It's weird doing live commentary over live scripted commentary over 
over recorded footage. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, this game is kind of weird. Yeah. I think you move too fucking quick, kind of. It's kind of weird. It just depends how big the levels are. Well, no. Like, even for combat, it looks like you run slightly too fast. Oh, I thought it looked okay. And, and like, I don't mean forward running speed. I mean also side running speed. Like, they were running just as fast sideways as they were forward. Which doesn't ever look natural, ever. Yeah, but it's okay. It's if it, even if it doesn't look natural, it's... Does this count as one of their exclusives? No. Fuck no, it's on everything. It might to them, though. This is my, what, Minecraft Xbox One version. Okay. Crossplay with who? PC. Sw that was a Nintendo Switch. Did you see that? Yeah. Whoever put not Switch, that's a lie. That was a, that was a, that was fucking bold. Thanks you know Xbox. What, Thanks you know what I like us. about that? And Sony made a comment on Twitter the other day or, or somewhere that they were like I think most people own two consoles and it's ours and Nintendo's console and like yeah. no reason to be scared of them they're not your competition yeah good job I didn't see Sony there there's a Sony Sony's probably there too. We're excited to welcome player made skins, maps, textures, and massive community run servers into the game itself. Because we know that the amazing content you create makes Minecraft even better. This fall, Minecraft will receive a free 4K update that brings more graphical options. Thank to God. I, I gotta be able to see them voxels, man. With all this talk about voxels. <laughs> it's like you get you upgrade to 4K and everything's smoothed out and shit, and you're like, wait, what the fuck? Is this what it's supposed to look like the whole time? <laughs> what the fuck? One that's inspired by the power of Xbox One X and available this fall. Everything looks weirdly hyper realistic and shit, and you're like, oh. Super duper graphics pack. I like it. <laughs> oh, this is like using the. Uh, oh, that's yeah. a mod actually, yeah. where they they upgraded like what stuff looked like and made it better looking. It's kind of neat. I think a lot of people use that mod, so. Yeah, I don't really care for it. Yeah, I like a lot of base stuff, but it does look pretty neat. It looks neat, but the fact that everything still voxels makes it. Well, Not look as I would rather it stay voxel, you know, otherwise it won't be fucking Minecraft anymore. Yeah, but then I don't think all these other be dumb. realistic sun rays are vital either. That's okay. <laughs> it's whatever. <laughs> Xbox. Look at the boxes. Hold on, hold on, hold on. The person that made it sold it. Am I wrong? Yeah. To them. So they didn't start shit. <laughs> What's this guy talking about? He's talking about their team. Yeah. I mean, Notch didn't make it by himself, you know? Yeah, that's true. Look at that menu. Delivering broad, diverse, and new games to Xbox. He just ends the show and you're like, wait a second. 
There were definitely 40 something games you know to. How many of those are in a montage at the end? Mario Party. I like. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> I like Jappy stuff. Xbox game with the Jappy times. Fuck yes. Oh, oh they're my gonna show. God. They're gonna it's show. It's the three on three fighter. They're gonna show the three on three fighter, bro. Holy shit. Good fucking job, Microsoft. Good job showing this shit before anyone else. They're like, fuck you, bro. What the that what the fuck is Sony even gonna show? God. This shit looks so good. Fucking God. God. Oh, it. it is literally Guilty Gear, man. Holy shit, it looks so good. It does. It looks really good. Oh my God. <laughs> Yo. Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh my fucking God. Do you oh. see? Oh. Oh, whoa. Oh. There's a lot of shit going on. Holy fuck. Yes. Holy shit. Look at the super. Look at the supers. This is the new Marvel. <laughs> <laughs> Holy <laughs> shit. Uh oh, oh go, my go God. To the Super Saiyan 3. Exists now, bitch. Fuck you, Super. No, oh, Super still says it exists. They just went past it. Uh, oh, wait, I'm sorry. 4 doesn't exist. My bad. My bad. My bad. Yeah. Oh. Dragon oh. Ball Fighter Z. Oh, my God. Where's that Dragon Ball Z fighter? <laughs> I don't know. It's definitely Dragon Ball Fighter Z. <laughs> yeah, God, God, that damn was cool. It, dude. That was cool. Exclusive. This oh. is a good show. They're not fucking around. They're not pulling any punches. God, who the fuck is this? I don't know. Probably Indie Dev. Damn, whoever this is, I feel kind of bad for showing something after something so fucking well, hype. It's also just a fighting game, you know. Like, so it's not for that everyone. Game looks fucking beautiful. Yeah, but if you don't care about fighting games with Dragon Ball, you didn't get hype. Yeah. Well, the magical thing about Dragon Ball is it'll pull in at least the Dragon Ball fans, too. Yeah. And I'm, I'm almost certain that game's not exclusive. No, it's not. There's no way. What is this? I don't know. Is it an RTS? It's exclusive. I think it's an RTS. We haven't seen an avatar this, moving around yet. Yeah, because there's a lot of dude. It's just fucking groups of people. Wait, Soul Calibur? This is Blade and Soul, I think. Yeah, this is Blade and Soul. The MMO. I'm pretty sure. Oh, okay. Yeah, it has, Some, it's it already has out action on action combat. It's already out on PC, right? Yeah. It looks kind of cool. I've never played it, but yeah, it has that action combat thing. Yeah, this is Blade and Soul. I imagine action combat's hard to do in an MMO. Yeah. But it looks cool. Especially where, like, lag is a thing. Um, it looks cool, though. Yeah. Um, <laughs> yeah, Korean MMOs are really good at fucking being over the top and pretty, you know, with a lot right. of Right, doesn't stuff. necessarily mean they are good. Oh, it's Black Desert. I'm sorry. I get fucking confused. Whatever. It's the same shit. Well, that's been on PC forever, so... Um, no, it's newer than Blade and Soul. But yeah, but, it's but been yeah, a year or so while. now. This is also exclusive, apparently. Odd Tales game? Who are Odd Tales? I don't know. Is that the people who make... It's not, right? It's not the people who make Odd World, right? I don't think so. Did you see the art? Whoa. This is fucking cool. It is. This is really fucking cool. This is the kind of shit you need, man. Fucking super good artsy shit like this. Oh my fucking god, so What beautiful. kind of game is this, man? It looks like out of this world and Is fucking, it like a point and clack? And or 
The Last Night. The Last Night. Holy shit. That looks nice as oh. fuck. God, fuck. He's running. Got in the cab. The art, that art style was like nothing I've ever seen before. Beautiful. The mixture of like both realistic assets and and pixel graphics and like this oh. cyberpunky type of looking world with neon. God. Another trailer. What is this? Oh. Oh, yeah. fucking beautiful. <laughs> we gotta get goofy on it. Holy shit. <laughs> This kinda does cool. look kind of cool, actually. But what kind of game is it? Yeah. What? <laughs> I'm lost now. <laughs> I don't know. Well, this is kind of doing the same thing a little bit. What? Oh. Is this just drugs in game form? What? It's just drugs! <laughs> it's drugs! <laughs> Fucking amazing! <laughs> I don't know what the, fuck, what is the going fuck is going on, on but it looks cool. I want it! <laughs> I'll I definitely keep too. my eye on it. Um, Holy shit! The eyeball on his head? Oh! What? No, don't. Don't fuck up now. Come on. The Artful Full Escape. escape. Alright. Come we was damn ready. ready! Yeah! <laughs> Good job! Project Vane. Why do I, I... I've seen this game. This game's trying to be like a Souls-like. I think Bamco... Not Bamco. Uh, someone else is making it. Popular dev. I just don't remember who. Oh, yeah. yeah We've yeah, seen yeah, this yeah, game. Yeah. Have you seen a video of it or just pictures? I think I saw a little bit of a video. And it looked really fucking good. Come on, stop. Come fuck. on, fuck. Stop it. There we go. Yeah. I like Souls combat stuff, so... Well, I like Souls. Games. You know? I, I can't think of any other games with Souls-like combat that I enjoy. Bloodborne. Uh, that's just Souls. <laughs> it's anime. That's good. That's all we're gonna see? Probably, yeah. That's okay. We already knew it existed, so... Bamco. Yeah, it's Bamco making it. Yeah, it looks good to me. Which is weird, because they have Souls, so maybe they're worried about them splitting because they don't have to work with Bamco, you know yeah you haven't shown 40 games yet Phil Spencer still got a lot of time though is it Halo 6. Crackdown. See Thieves. See Thieves. See Thieves. I I haven't figured good out shit, what man. I haven't figured out what makes this game so good yet, but I I, I just can it feel it. It looks cool. It mm. looks cool. I just need a, reasons to do things. To voyage of the secret shrine. Okay. Brawling brawling Becca. <laughs> Going up to the crow's nest. Sick. Yeah. Fuck yeah. <laughs> Fuck yeah. Fuck yeah, bro. What? <laughs> okay. Swimming underwater is cool. Yeah. I don't think we've actually seen this before. Is there no air meter? Probably is. It's probably going for air right now. Okay, he breathed in, so. You pick up that wood. Cannonballs. <laughs> Shark? Shark makes sense. Oh man, Kraken, bro. Krakens are where it's at. Shark! Shark! With spears already in it. 
oh shit. <laughs> they were like, fuck. Get the treasure. Abandon the treasure. And he's like, fuck this shit. I'm getting this. Uh oh. Is he gonna make I it? I feel like you have to like put it on something. <laughs> fuck it. Nope. Okay, that's weird. Just put it in your pocket. I guess that works. That'd be cool if you had to get to a side and someone has to hoist it up or something, you know? Oh. Oh, fuck. Wait, I found that loot. What the fuck? <laughs> mm. Oh, whoo, what a transition. <laughs> nice transition, by the way. The water looks good. Yeah. It's weird to point out, but it's super important since that's what you're going to see a lot of the fucking time when yeah. you're on the boat, you know, on your ship. It's a, it's a rock with a face on. Are they blowing his ship up while he's gone? Son of a bitch. Fuck it. It's not a fucking handle business. Yo. Uh oh. Oh yeah, fucking reload that shit. That's cool. Oh. This game looks fucking cool, man. Yeah, but I... What? Eat that banana. <laughs> Kill a lot. Oh. I just need to know the, the, what I'm doing. He just shot himself. <laughs> Pull out the map real quick. Check this shit out. I love that. Where you like... Hey, look yeah. at this. This is something you get a few friends with. And you just go on some fucking adventures. And it'd just be great. As long as those adventures have purpose. Yeah. I can only swim to get treasure once or twice before it's like, what am I doing? Well, so I doubt... what they're doing right now looks more interesting. Well, yeah. But I doubt there's, like, story, you know? It's open world. Where everyone can be in it. <sighs> I don't know how open, you know? Maybe it's open world. There has like, to be an angle. No, no Man's Sky. You know, there might be. But who gets to it first? Uh, how are you, you... you going to determine that? Your teams go together, I assume. Like a raid boss? One person gets the treasure? I don't think it's like an MMO. Oh, they kept saying like it's online. I think you queue up with these four people. And that's it? Well, what about pirate fights? Just They're NPCs? just NPCs. I don't know, man. Otherwise, how would they do shit like this, you know? Yeah, I guess so. I feel like you wouldn't have a trailer like this if you thought otherwise. Maybe it's like Subnautica. Like, Which is just single player. Yeah, well, not... Uh, <laughs> it's a world that's made once. Like, it's not procedurally generated. Oh, that, I, I think so. Oh. That's good. Fuck you, stop fucking digging! Glad I live for more loot, guys. Oh no, skellies! Oh, let me run to where they're all spawn instead of the obvious way to go. Alright. See if these it looks tight. I've been, I've been talking about it. I, I've got my eye on it. It could be the one, you know. It could yeah. be the, the one game. I just, oh, he tries to get out of the water. Shark just grabs his ass. Oh, his friend's gonna come up from behind and shoot him. Yeah, the boat. Yeah, Brawl and Becca. Someone had to watch the boat, bro. Right, here Fuck they come. Yeah. Did they have treasure as well? I think they had something. Looks like they had bags of them. Oh. Wow, we gotta upgrade those guns. Yeah, this game looks fucking cool, man. That said, again, the thing comes out that there's potential for me to just buy it on fucking Windows, you know? Oh, yeah. If it's on PC. But here's another problem. I will get it on uh, PC. Windows 10 games still require Xbox Live. 
Yeah, but you can just make an account on there, you know. And pay for it, yeah. What the fuck? Are you serious? Yeah. You can't just play the PC versions online for free? You have to no, fucking... you gotta go through Xbox Live. What the fuck? Yeah. That's fucking dumb. I like to think that's why they keep it like that, man. So they can charge you? So that at least they get the Xbox Live money from you. God damn. And I get it, it's only 60 bucks a year, but... Yeah. And no matter what I buy it on, it's just another thing I have to buy just for one game, you know? But the show's been pretty good, so... It might be... Might be more games. games, you know? Uh-huh, ammo chest. Yeah, I figured you just... You don't just have, like, fucking infinite. Infinite, right. Because then it'd just be dumb. What's he gonna do? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Is he getting in the cannon? What's Fuck up, bitches? yeah! Holy shit. What if he just missed? What if he hits it? Uh, yeah, oh. I was gonna say, it looks like it hurts. Look, there's player names. But they could just be right. NPC name things, you know? Well, no, if they start jumping around like goofs. They'll never show that in trailers, dude. Could happen. Fucking the first, sword the, fight him, dude. I'll say the first trailer for Sea of Thieves had you, YouTubers playing it, and they looked goofy. They were like, how do I how do I climb up the ladder? I don't even know how to do this. <laughs> and I was like, yeah, that's perfect. That's exactly what it would be like. There would never be a fucking pirate voiceover going on. Shark has to get him. Yep. <laughs> it's like, wait, guys, wait, fuck. All right, that looks good. That's rare, you know. Rare is actually making something. A substance, cool, man. Um, Exclusive. I think they're gonna show blood stained here as well eventually. Yeah. What is this? Huh. It's crazy to me so how how many hands by the X. Is this VR? Is, kind of is X gonna like, have VR? I don't think so. Oh. oh Does don't... that mean it's coming out August second? That didn't show me shit, man. That's pretty ridiculous. August second, and it didn't show. You know what's ridiculous? How many launch titles this system upgrade is having? Yeah. Wait, what the fuck was that? Is that Conquer? That was Conquer. Don't fuck with me. Don't. Don't fuck with me. No, that's just a little fox. That is fucking Conquer, dog. That's not Conquer. Oh, yeah, it's right. not Conquer, bro. Fuck. <laughs> Fuck. Yeah, it's a little puppy dog. <laughs> Spin your tail, dog. Why do you spin his tail like that? I don't know. I feel like I know this character. I just don't know any of his games. Collectathon. Looks fucking cool. Yeah. I feel like I've seen this game before. I don't know. It looks neat. I like it. <laughs> this is Bubbis. Oh. <laughs> Bubsy, what the fuck? Nah. It does look good. Yeah. Huh. It's cool, man. What's the name? I like that digging underground yeah. shit. That looked cool. And I like how lively he looks. And kind of everything looks. Yeah. It looks really well done. Cool. There's some 2D ones too. Super, Super Lucky Lucky's Tales. Tales. Lucky's Tale. Remember? Like. So his name is Lucky, I guess? Is Lucky's Tales a game already? I swear it is. Well, there's. there's Conker's Tales or something like that. Is the other old and, ones. Yeah, you know? that's right. And that's when Conker was like friendly and. I wonder if this is like I think a, this play is a play on, play on, on it. it. Yeah. But just different characters, I guess. okay, I guess. It looks pretty fucking cool. Looks alright. I liked it. Looks alright. I like little adventure games. I like platformers. I don't, I don't think fucking Xbox has any of those, you know? So. Hey, man, what about Halo? <laughs> that's, not, 
No. <laughs> Not the devil. Fuck you, Satan. <laughs> Super See, like, Lucky's tail. The way it's like that, like it's a play on. It has to be a play on conquer, you know. Right. And then it just shows Conquer right here. I'm like, wait, what the fuck is going on? Oh, this is Cups or whatever. Cuphead, right? You think so? Yeah. Black and white. Was it was Cuphead not black and white? No. Oh. Uh, has been seen before. <laughs> oh, it's color now. Oh, it is Cuphead. Okay. <laughs> so this is the re-reveal, apparently. They're going to have levels now, so we'll see. Yeah. Oh, looks nice, actually. It's still shmup, you know? The art style's still really good. Yeah. You gonna enhance that shit on Xbox One X, boy? Or uh, what? <laughs> no. <laughs> it's a fucking drawing. It's a redraw everything. Exclusive. Why was there a pause right there? It was probably just... Because it's Microsoft Studios. Sumo Digital. Crackdown. Sounds, sounds familiar. Crackdown. Terry Crews! Terry Crews! Holy shit! Perfect. Please don't. Come on. Terry Crews is like the best part, man. Come on. Come the fuck on, man. This is cool, but show me gameplay. It's cracked down, so... Do you have to show gameplay, because... Crackdown is just cracked down until you show me something new. Yeah. I think they're about to. See this now. side shit? Okay. Mm, yeah, fucking... Okay. Multiplayer? Looks like it. Alright. Is Crackdown, <laughs> like, this kind of art style before? It was in the second game. Oh, okay. They cel shaded it. Okay. Um, I like I like the cel shaded. And this is like I a different it's kinda like a combination Crack of the two. Crackdown three is an Xbox Play Anywhere title for one and Windows. Cool. Yeah. Oh the fucking copyright music. <laughs> oh damn it. That's alright. Look at that shoot. Boo. Is it just me or like, is this a bad trailer? It's okay. I don't, I don't think it's particularly good. Yeah. The thing you want to show me of Crackdown is all the new cool shit I can do. Yeah. Because no one cares about the characters. The fact that you can do co-op is cool. Yeah, that's like the uh, only thing I really saw. That was like different than any other Crackdown. And I love Crackdown 1, you know? I didn't play 2, but like 1 is good. But the uh, game here, itself here comes here comes bad. the forty There's games. A, whole a lot of new games. Diverse creators, so here comes the Bro, is this the end? This has to be the end. They're gonna show this oh, and then one more. Well, at least game. they're gonna do a I think they're gonna game. yeah. Unruly Heroes looks fucking cool. Path of Exiles coming to Xbox, that's neat. Battle Rides coming there too. Battle Rides pretty fucking cool. Surviving more. Ooh. So this is where they're gonna get their forty from. Fable Fortune card game. Great. It's neat. Observer, some horror Ooh. game. It looks like. Oh, that's cool. Cyber horror. Robocraft. Robo Could be cool. I see probably a lot of people play it. Dunk, Dunk Lords. <laughs> looks silly as shit. Minimum Masters. It looks like it's a like tower, a tower defense, defense thing. thing. Yeah. Ooh. Oh, Brawl, Brawl out. I remember. Donkey played it. Is that bad? <laughs> oh, it looks silly. Ooblets? Ooblets also looks silly, but it could be something, you know. Dark and light. 
Oh, that's okay. Who's all right? Strange Brigade. Whoa. I don't know what that is, but it looks interesting. Yeah. This oh, looks cool, too. Fuck yeah. I like little voxels of the like games. Yeah, Hello, right, neighbor. right. Hello, yeah, neighbor, right. This. God damn. Hopefully that game gets finished eventually. Fuck yes, wow. shift. Fuck, holy shit. Give me that. Go Conan, back. Conan's stupid. No one stupid. gives a fuck about Conan <laughs> Exiles. Bro, no one. You gonna have you have dick physics still in the Xbox version? <laughs> Probably not. You gonna censor so, it? <laughs> so what do I want it for? At Xbox, it's not just about finding creative artists. We will have dick physics. Holy shit! Oh <laughs> fuck! <laughs> no balls. We're having balls physics as well. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> one more game. He has to have something big. Halo? Halo, maybe? And this is not just a milestone for the program and the independent developer community. It's a milestone for everyone. Stone. Loves great games. I hope you're reminded today why it's so great to be a gamer on Xbox. Don't just end the show. Adventure, story, skill, surprise. These next few games bring it all together. Let's start okay. with... Is this gonna be Suda? He hasn't had a new game. What if it was fucking D4 too? No, we saw this earlier. We saw that name earlier. Yeah. So just the indie dev. Who the fuck's this? Graphic looks cool. It looks like Firewatch. But it's obviously not. But I mean, oh, I think I think I know what this is. I, well, maybe I don't know. Looks interesting enough, though. No, it's something else. It's got Souls combat. Yeah, it's always welcome. I, I like that combat style. Sure. Deliberate and fucking. It also looks like it's co-op. Yeah. Maybe not. Whoa. Maybe you're just with that person. What is it? Looks all right. Look, I'm. You got my interest. Um, I will. Fuck. Kingdom Hearts. Close the doors. Big dude. So like Boss? They have no faces. You know? Yeah. That's been disturbing me a little bit. Could be oh, the minimalistic my God. style, but I think it is. Ashen, okay. Ashen. Never heard of this shit yet, so Yeah, it looks cool though. Could be good. These games could be fucking out on Steam right now, we have no idea. Just But I'm pretty sure that's the name. Premiere this shit. Worldwide. Squeenix. Square? Is this an Iodos game? No, this is fucking... Light, uh, Life, Life is Strange, Strange 2? 2? Yeah. I thought it was Life is Strange 2. I saw the skateboard. There ain't no skateboards in any of our this game. Ooh, yeah, it's definitely Life is Strange 2. That, that wasn't Chloe. That was the main girl, right? Yeah, what's the canonical? She doesn't smoke, I'm pretty sure. Oh, I don't know. This is Chloe. She's got different hair. That's, that's not Chloe... Chloe would have or to be dead. Maybe she's just like Chloe, you know? Spoilers, Chloe would have to be dead for the world to exist. Yeah. That's, that's Chloe. That is. No. Or that's no, her. No, it's her, it's her. She just changed she's her hair. Older. Yeah, uh, I yeah. think some time okay. went by. Yeah. But she looks a lot like fucking Chloe, though. Probably because Chloe had to die, so she kind of... Just to remember her. Yeah, it started being living, a lot more like you know, her. Yeah. Life is Strange 1 was not perfect. But you definitely got. I would definitely like to play a second one. For sure. Yeah. Life is Strange 2. This is big. 
before the storm. Before the storm. Episode one of three. So that is Chloe? Maybe? Right? No, I don't think so. Before the storm, still. The storm. That has to be way before. I don't know. Maybe it's while the main girl's. Oh, the Shadow like, of War. Okay. Is this, is this a sequel to the other one? Yeah. Oh. This actually got announced about a month ago. Oh, I didn't know. <laughs> yeah. I heard the first one's really good, so. Yeah. But since I haven't played the first one, this is just kind of cool to us. Listen up, bitch. Wait a second. Who are you playing as? I don't think either one. That's weird. Well, sometimes shit, weird shit happens like that in the game. But why would they I show heard, it But you? not like this. Well, I don't think they showed it. Showed it. You know. I think they want to, like, at least simulate wow. some of that shit, you know? Because they get stronger whenever they kill people, mm -hmm. too. Just in general, I think. That was pretty cool. Yeah. Maybe this is like, what is the opening tutorial to that one system? So it shows you how he beat him, and when you beat him, you'll take his place or whatever. Yeah. Or someone will take his place. Those wraith powers are fucking cool. Yeah. Spoilers for anyone who doesn't know. Now you fucking know. Yeah. So. The nemesis mode, that's what it was called. Yeah. Looks cool. Oh, yeah, that's right. It has Batman combat, doesn't it? Yeah, I think so. A lot of, a lot of crowd control, you know? A lot of popping back and forth. But just like... I want to say just like Batman. You fuck around too much. You can't get your ass beat. Oh, absolutely. You, know? you aren't. You aren't just a fucking god. What's up, man? Dodge his attacks sliding through his legs. Oh, well, he sure didn't do that. There you go. He didn't press the B button hard enough. Damn. Holy shit. That was an ass beat. Hold B to dominate his ass. What does that do? Dude, you fucking... You just fucking put him in a leash. There you go. Ghostbusters ass. They join you? <laughs> Interesting. This is fucking cool. It depends what he does from here on out. Does he fight for you in the Nemesis system, I wonder? He's obviously the first person you probably end up dominating. Yes. I assume there won't, be a, there won't be a cutscene every time other than, all right, I'll join. Yeah. Okay. We're enormously expanding the open world of Mordor to new regions like Saragos and Tirith Ungol. Mordor's a massive living, breathing world filled with orc society, tribes, and wildlife, as well as stories and secrets. Hmm. Uh oh. Humpty. 
I bet there's a way to skip this. Oh shit! Oh fuck! How much damage he took? He's almost dead. Oh, come on, bro! Use your counter. Fuck. I think it's just showing off stuff. Oh. There he goes. Finally. You got a lot of health back for some reason. I don't think that's. I think it's from the counter you did. She's gonna dominate him too. Can he get him though? Probably. Oh. Why would you ever kill him? Yeah, I don't know. Maybe you can only have a certain amount of people on your team. Maybe that's it. There's five over there. I can see that. Level 89. Oh, this is. Oh, fuck. Oh. Yeah, that's the keep, but he looks pretty well armed right now. It's probably some end game shit. What if he loses here? I think that's the way to the way to play it eh, to lose. For the for the sake of the trailer. We'll see. Shut up, bro. <laughs> I like his little clips. It's good. Looks like he'll be a main character. Oh, they're not going to show any of it. Okay. October 10th. Looks really fucking cool. <laughs> They're just at the Sony conference, too. Y'all are fucked up. Alright, what's this? This is big, apparently. So these next couple games are big. Is this Shenmue? No. Fair enough. Shenmue. Is this Halo? No. It's it's Ori. Oh fuck! It it's is Ori. Ori. We saw this leaked earlier today, which sucks, you know. But it's marketing, so I can't get mad about being spoiled about marketing. We still haven't played the first one, but yeah, I need to. It's supposed it's to like be really good. Ori and the Willowing Wisp, or whatever is this one? Will of the Wisp. Will of the Wisp. That's right. It's a weird way of putting it, but. And this game last the last Ori was exclusive to Xbox, technically you know even though it's on Steam. It's really pretty, man. It's good to see they're pushing this. Yeah. Like Microsoft's pushing this. I like how there's a dude playing piano with the music. Yes. It's fucking cool. It was kind of like at EA's conference when the guys were playing drums with Madden. Yeah, well, this, <laughs> this, this guy's actually, you know, the composer. <laughs> it's kind of like that time Nintendo did the fucking orchestra thing. <laughs> oh, fuck, that was stupid. But to be fair, like, kind of like when uh, Sony did the like, thing with God of War, man. <laughs> Just had an orchestra playing for like 10 minutes, and you're like, what the fuck is going on? Go to war? Go to war? <sighs> Yo, this Ori. Hey, buddy. It's okay. Where's your fucking dead parents? I'm fucking sorry. Oh, look at that. <laughs> Fuck. I feel like there's gonna be feels to be had whenever I play the first one finally. <laughs> and yeah. this one when it comes up. Oh shit, that was a lot of dead shit. Yeah. Holy dude. shit. Alright. <laughs> Ori and the Will of the Wisp. Okay. Looks good. Looks good. You can end the show. You can end the show now. Ori affirms my belief in the beauty, artistry, and art within the art of games. We believe that games, like books, movies, and music, should be celebrated.
celebrated and enjoyed by countless generations. We're passionate about preserving and celebrating the games you own, the classics of the past, and the genres you love to play. Where is this going? That's why two years ago we launched the Xbox okay. Backwards Compatibility gotcha. Program to bring Xbox 360 games to your Xbox One. Good shit. Good. Yeah. Very good. And that's that's very good, right? Let's go. Regular Xbox. Every single fucking one of them. Regular Xbox. Holy shit! Oh my god! Fuck that's yeah! Big. Oh, good job. <laughs> well done, sir. Well done. How many games you got? <laughs> That's good. That's big. Hit him with that Crimson Skies. Hit him with <laughs> fucking Psychonauts 1. Hit him with everything. Halo Kodor? Guys, ever again? Say say online gameplay too, and you get you fuck. I don't know, man. I'll, I'll play, fuck, man. I'm fuck. Oh, fuck, man. Oh. Crimson Skies, man. I love Crimson Skies. That's pretty cool. That's good. You should do that. But they shouldn't just release a four a 4K yeah. version. Skyrim. For 4K. Good. Injustice 2. Final Fantasy 15. Doom, Fallout 4. Yeah, Chess. <laughs> okay. This there is big. Go. Yeah, definitely say that Rocket League. You probably already have a large library of titles that you own today that will automatically get better on Xbox One X. That's the fucking way to do it right there. We showcase God the damn. They all matter. The lineup of different types of oh, oh God. Dragon Ball. Does he have one more thing? Forty-two games, including twenty-two with console exclusivity on Xbox One. And you're also going to be able to play all of the biggest cross-platform blockbusters on Xbox One. And every game will play great across the Xbox One family. And on Xbox One X, runs every single game you. God, please. So if you haven't joined the Xbox One family, please say a better price. This week you'll find I don't think you'll announce the price. What's the S? The small one. Just regular Xbox One. People don't sound upset about it, so... Well, they worked, but, the, we worked you know, them the whole time, you know? Yeah. God damn. With a really great partner. They've been with us from the earliest days of Project Scorpio. And they're building an incredible game that takes advantage of the power... Fuck. What is this? You didn't save it to the end for nothing. Oh, that's right, Anthem. Oh, yeah. Holy shit. I forgot. New IP. It's the 
lifeblood of our industry. It's also risky. At EA, you have teams dreaming up a lot of projects, and only the greatest will make it their way through. And that's okay. It's all a part of the creative process. We've canceled Anthem. What the fuck? <laughs> it's been one day, dog. We heard the feedback. Looks like Dead Space. <laughs> I'm sorry. Did they just invert the colors from yesterday where it was red? Yeah. I really hate it. I really just hate that EA background in general. Yeah. It hurts just to look at, man. It's like shit. It's not something you show for lengthy periods. That should be in a fucking movie, dude. <laughs> we are so excited to share this with all of you. On behalf of the team of Bioware, yeah. let's see what this game looks like running on an Xbox One S. Here's John Warner from Bioware to make sure. Yeah, what the fuck does this game actually even look like? We saw the teaser, it didn't show us anything. Real time. So we're using Frostbite. Which is good. Yeah. Frostbite is good. You know. Means they can focus on making a game. Yeah. Horizon? <laughs> Was that just a, a silk strider dino? Robot? Yo. I'll say those facial animations <laughs> they they went back and souped those up after fucking Andromeda, right? Yeah. I'm sure different team, you know. Yeah. It was stupid. You're a creative character. Cause he called you freelancer. That's good though. Just something to be aware of. This is all real time, he said. In the world of Anthem, you and your friends are freelancers. Don't fucking look at me. Get him away. Ally of the week. What the fuck was that? Hmm. That's a tight fit, man. That's a tight fit. As it should be, though, you know. Don't don't gain any weight. <laughs> Every player will own an array of exosuits we call javelins. These suits give players superhuman capabilities and are heavily customizable so they look and play how you want. Paul joined level 32. Co-op. Yeah. Oh man, this is... Oh! This is pretty fucking cool. But, you know, remember what else looked cool one time, but it wasn't for Bioware, it's from Ubisoft. Fucking... Stupid ass fucking God! What the fuck was that game called? It was a Tom Clancy game, I thought. The Division. <laughs> oh, I don't remember a time it looked cool, but I'll take your word for it. At the very beginning, it did. <laughs> when it when there wasn't a bunch of lies, you know. I don't know. The movement looks cool in this game. Yeah, but how much of it is? Not I don't know. automated. Like how much of it is like really that free, or how much of am I just following objective lines? Is this an open world? I'm wondering. <laughs> I told you, it's gonna be fucking monster with guns. I fucking told you. It literally looks like fucking Mass Effect, but. Third person shooter, combat. Enemies to fight. Oh. Going in the water! And the water had fucking. Oh, no. 
things in it. Discovery bonus, yeah. Cool. Um, it doesn't look anything like Mass Effect, by the way, so far. You don't think so? No. It literally doesn't look like it plays like Mass Effect so far. I mean, it's like a third person shooter. Yeah. With I RPG guess a elements. Bit of the new one. Yeah. And there's little like enemies little to nerves. fight. Yeah, I guess so. <laughs> oh, bro. God, I hate this shit. This forced fucking. I wish they would just do it real. Yeah. Yo, that little fucking bitch, he ain't been playing. <laughs> fucking sorry ass. <laughs> yeah, man, he said he was sick. Oh, dude, I saw him at the store the other day. He looked fine to me. What the fuck? Fuck that. Let's go without him. That guy's running like a. The, the, the legs are like. Weird. Bent. Yeah. How they're able to put their whole leg through that doesn't make sense. See, like all that's uh, all like that stuff. Shit. Yeah, like that's obviously a scripted event happening. So, it's so quiet. Well, are you yelling while you play a game? Yeah, you you are, but there no more people just talk. I just, I just mean like. The video is quiet, kind of. I don't know. Oh, I don't know. I say the gunfire sure is loud compared to the fucking talking and the music. That's pretty cool. That was a little ridiculous. God damn. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> Please be something good. Random loot. Okay, Cherries. So that was Jara's wrath, you Fucking stupid. God damn it. So. So it has randomized loot, like Borderlands or Division. Yeah, man. That's what it makes me think of is the fucking Division. Yeah, but the Division's defining characteristic was like the Dark Zone. Yeah. Fighting each other. So we'll see if we see any of that stuff or if it's just together. I don't know, the PvE was pretty big too. It's just you didn't see everybody running around in the open world. Unless you teamed up with them. I think this looks good. You're supposed to fly into the store? That person's suit's fucking cool. Why would. No! What's funny is like, you know in the real game, there's like an objective marker, so they know to go there. But if I just saw that, I think I would not just jump off a fucking ledge towards it, personally. I'd fly into that shit. <laughs> like, well, let's see what the fuck this does. Fuck it. The scissor wheel now? What is this, Forza again? It's Anthem. Um, oh no, it's just scissor wheel. Of everything. It is Forza, motherfucker! I told you, it's all that desert, man. Yeah, that should be the last thing. I, I can't think of anything bigger than Anthem we didn't show them. Yeah, I think Unless they have something they think is bigger. There's Shadow. There's just an overall Microsoft fucking. So I think Anthem trailer. looked pretty good. Yeah. Um, we'll see though. Everything was very like. Right in a bubble. In a bubble, you know. And they've also been pretty fucking honestly fucking garbage lately, so. Um, with Andromeda, and even Dragon Quest Inquisition had its problems, you know? So, like, I want to see what Chocobos look like drifting in 4K, bro. That's what <laughs> I want to see. Fuck, man. And uh, Assassin's Creed looked good. Um, the Dragon God, Ball looked fucking good. That was good. the best looking game, period, Sea of Thieves me. looked good. Crackdown was kind of let down. The Shadows game looked good. Yeah. Yeah, Sea um, of Thieves, you're right. That did looked really fucking good. Yeah. Metro looks fucking great. Metro looked really good. It was a good conference. It was a real good conference. Like, Some low points, but overall, uh, I think I think it's a low A for me. Yeah, I think it's A minus. I think it's yeah. A minus. I believe that's it. Um, yeah. If you join us, the world exclusive to see these co stream at. Okay, that's so cool. get on mixer. We're see not gonna mixer. That's that's the whole Xbox yeah. thing for that. 
So that's just okay. GameSpot talking so, about it now. So we're not going to do that, but um, we will be back with the uh, Bethesda thing. Um, Bethesda conference later, we'll be watching that. Yeah. And then we're going to try to watch Devolver Digital's conference as well, if I can fucking find it. But uh, over, I give it A minus. I think it's pretty good. Yeah, same man. Um, you know what? They hit us with like stuff that we wanted. That's that's the thing. Like, yeah. where are the games at? Where? What the fuck? Who cares? You know. And then they were like, "Well, here's why you should care." And you're like, "Okay, I, I get it." But come on, where are the games at? And they're like, "Well, here's the fucking games, dog." And I was like, "Oh." Backward compatibility with Crimson Skies is amazing. The fact that they literally like used that game specifically too. After we had just said it, just it. like. You know, let's see fucking Christmas skies. <laughs> Holy shit. And someone just broke my Xbox not too long ago, so... I could use the Xbox One to play Christmas skies. <laughs> yeah, man. <laughs> we'll see. Fuck. One X, I don't know about that, but 200 bucks for an S version is not too bad. You know, 500 is a lot. Uh, I wish it was cheaper. They're but, trying to show the conference again. That's interesting. But there was, there was a few things that they touched on, and I was like, okay, I, I get it. You know, they did... Look like they put a lot of fucking, for once I say effort, into the fucking system. Like, the, I didn't care yeah. about the Xbox One at first, you know. You know, the X actually seems kind of fucking cool. Um, and you would never hear me say that just about the Xbox yeah, One in general. You know, so, the game still got to come out. I, and they still got to be yeah. really exclusive. Uh, you can't be on Steam and be exclusive. Um, yeah. You can be on Windows Store, I think, because of the thing I talked about earlier. Yeah, that's true for the um, live thing. For the live, Xbox Live thing. It'd be cool if, like, because uh, I don't think all the games do it, but, like, you own one on one. I think you own one on the other, too. Yeah, I think I think that's true they for most of it. the games that Microsoft owns. Yeah. yeah. Um, and that would be fine. If they, if they do it like that. Um, Especially if it could cross-save at any time. That'd be great. Like, keep it in a cloud somewhere and just... Oh, I'm playing on PC right now. Yeah. Oh, I'm playing here. You know, that'd be me. Um. Because, yeah. like, maybe, like, I just want to chill and play it on the fucking one. Or I want to record it. So I'm going to get on my fucking computer and do it. Because it's easier. Yeah. But. Yeah, so it's really good, man. So if you had to buy one game that they showed today, what do you buy? Oh, fuck. You only get one. Out of all of them? Out of all of them. <clears throat> it's tough. There's a couple. I think it's a toss up for me, man. Which 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 two? It'd be like it'd be like Sea of Thieves would be one if I get people to play with me. That's the only way. Otherwise right. I'm not gonna play that shit by myself. Otherwise, like I don't know, that that pixel game that Oh my had, god, I had forgot. The realistic about that. looking like crazy shit in the background. You know what? I don't remember what that was, but I'm changing my answer to that. That's that the game, game I want, bro. Looks so artistically yeah. like well done, like it made me cream. I'm like, <laughs> god damn, man. Oh fuck. And, and Dragon Ball. I'm sorry. I got Oh, lot. Dragon Ball's there Dragon too. Dragon Ball are good good because I like fighting games, so it looks good. Sony, Nintendo, ah! you got a fucking uphill battle now. Yeah. Um, we'll get there though. Yeah, we'll get there. But that's the end of reactions for now. Be sure to grab Shiny in your day. Catch you guys next time. Later. Peace.